Hey guys, Brady from ROG Ally Pro here to show you how to install Playnight. Playnight is an open source video game library manager designed to unify the interface for all your games across various platforms. It allows you to import games from major services like Steam, Epic, Origin, Xbox Game Pass, and Battle.net, including those that are not installed. It also supports a variety of console emulators, making it versatile for both PC and console games. Let's get into installing Playnight. Open your browser and look up Playnight, and it will be the first result on the page. Then click the green download button in the middle of the page. It will then install the installer to your ROG Ally. On the installer screen, select where you want to install Playnight to, and then make sure to use the drop-down menu and select Portable. It will then download onto your device. The first time configuration screen will come up. Click Next and select what game libraries you want to show in Playnight. I personally just want Steam, Battle.net and Epic Games. Then you will log in to each account in order to authenticate it and add to Playnight. I will show you one and then skip the rest of them just for the sake of time. If you're still here, make sure to click on the like button as well as the subscribe button to help support us. Playnight will say checking authentication status and then it will say user authenticated. That is how you know you successfully authenticated and can click next. Once you add each account, Playnight will load the metadata of that game into the software. This may take a minute. To add your own games to Playnight, go to the controller in the left-hand corner, click Add Game, and then choose Scan Automatically, and then select the folder that the game is in. I tried it with Minecraft, but I was in the wrong folder. To change a game's artwork, you want to right-click the game you want to change, and then click Edit then select Download Metadata in the bottom left corner of the pop-up. If there are multiple games with the same name, find the correct one, and then click Select. In the right side of the screen, select everything you want to copy over from the updated metadata. It will then replace the old one. Finally, click Select, and it will then update. To change the theme of the Playnight desktop and the full-screen version, click the controller in the top left of the screen. Then go to Add-ons, and go to Playnight Full Screen and Playnight Desktop, and select the theme you want and click Install. It may ask you to restart your Playnight after installing. In order to get Playnight to automatically launch, there is a little fiddling around you need to do in both Armory Crate and Playnight. First, open Armory Crate and click the Add button at the main menu and press either LB or RB to open a custom file. Then navigate to where you installed Playnight and select Playnight.FullScreen app, then click Done. Now, in Armory Crate, go to Content, then System, and scroll down and uncheck Run Armory Crate SA at Startup. Now open Playnight, go to the controller in the corner and down to Settings. Then check off Launch in full screen mode and launch Playnight at Startup. There you go, that is how you install Playnight onto your ROG Ally. If you enjoyed the video, comment down below what your most played games are on your ROG Ally. Check out our website, rogally.pro, where we post guides, game settings, tips and tricks, and more about the ROG Ally. Until next time.